Vacationers flock to Bald Head Island in North Carolina for summer fun and sun. But for an eight-year-old boy, the pristine waters near the Cape Islands turned terrifying Sunday afternoon when a shark attacked him near the shore. I just find a reference to a shark bite. The shark grabbed him by the leg, but left him with only puncture wounds. He was treated at a local hospital and is expected to make a full recovery. It's the third reported shark attack along the North Carolina coast this month alone. We got a shark right here. 19-year-old surfer Austin Reed suffered a bite to his foot last week, leaving him with a 10-inch wound. I told my friend, I was like, I think I just got bit by a shark. I kind of glanced at it and I saw there was like blood in the water. And two weeks ago, 17-year-old Paige Winter lost her left leg and two fingers fighting off a shark. Paige was going backwards and she was underwater. And when I pulled her up, a shark came up with her and it was a big shark. A one-time Marine, her father, now an EMT, repeatedly punching the predator, likely saving her life. I was hitting it and I hit it with everything I could and it let go. Surprisingly, Paige defending sharks even after her attack. I think I could transform this into something good for me and good for sharks and good for the environment too. Her father just grateful she survived. A shark took her leg, uh, but it did not take her spirit.